What's up, Geek Girl World? This is Ari. Welcome to Reactions. Today I'm going to be reacting to the new The Girl in the Spider's Web trailer. And I'm pretty sure this is a continuation of the Millennium series with the Dragon Tattoo, or they're calling it the Dragon Tattoo series. I see that in their little description here. It comes in theaters November 9th. So let's see what this trailer has in store for us. Sorry I said those things. You know how much I love you, don't you? Who the hell are you? Transferring 20% of your cash to these two girls. I'm calling down to security. The rest, I'm transferring to your wife. <laughs> yeah, Come you're not up. calling now. <laughs> I have one line. Take your child and leave. He won't hurt you again. Mr. Chen has bankrolled your company for years. Isn't this his wife? Try to contact your wife again, or if anything unexpected should happen to her, this video will be sent to you. <laughs> Who are you? Oh no, it's not funny to laugh at someone's pain, I guess. The right or wrong. But he, he had it coming. The girl who hurts men. Who hurt women. Why did you have everyone but me? Oh, Why is it this bad? Why is it spiders don't get stuck in their own webs? Okay, so I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, it definitely looks good. It definitely looks like it's going to have some really cool um, moments in it. Um... But this hasn't really, I don't know, this is, I don't know. I, I don't know if I really want a reboot of this because it looks like they're trying to reboot this with Claire Foy, who I think is awesome. I loved her in The Crown both seasons. She was just perfect and phenomenal. But I was kind of like, I, I mean, I was really, you know, Attached to Nomi Rapace. I think it's Rapace. Yeah, Nomi Rapace or Numi Rapace. I was really attached to her in the series. And this book, I'm not really sure if this is the one that wasn't written by Stieg Larsson um, before he died. Um, I think this is like one that was written after. So I just, I'm not sure how, too sure how I feel about it. But all in all, it still looks good. I mean, it look like the trailer looks good. It looks interesting enough. Um, I'm just not sure if this is going to be a first nighter for me. And yeah, and and Claire Foy looks good in it, but I'm just still a little iffy on whether or not I'm I'm into this without. I'm into an American version of this anyway. Like, yeah, I'm still, like, iffy if I'm, if I really need an Americanized version of this series. 
which, because I loved, loved, loved the original version. I think it was Sweden. Yeah, a Swedish version or of it with Nomi Repace. I, I, that, I mean, we don't really, do we really have to Americanize everything? I mean, really? Subtitles work. People can read and go to the movies. So, <laughs> I don't, I don't, I, I, I'm, meh. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It, it, it looks good. It looks good. That's all I can say for right now. It looks good. My interest in it is, do we really need it? Is it really necessary, I guess? That's not really piquing my interest. I can't really say anything as far as, like, the trailer itself is detracting or anything like that. It's just, do we really need it? And that, I don't know. So anyway, let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Remember, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. Visit our website, geekorworld.com, where we sell Funko Pops. Subscribe to us on Instagram. Subscribe to us on Stardust app, because I'll be posting re um, reactions on the Stardust app, so subscribe to us there. And subscribe to us here on YouTube. Click that notifications button and subscribe here for more reactions. Bye.